Hello, this is Tara Bayani. Thank you for being here. This is my vibrational reading. Please do your own research for entertainment purposes and allegedly's, allegedly's, allegedly's. After reading the comments, I decided to ask directly, is he at that point? This is what I got right here. It looks like a total mess, but I left it on the table. I did have to shift these down so I could see them. Uh, yes. So anyways, you know the subject matter, okay? Um, so I'm not going to say the word. They don't like that. So this is just a clarification based on what I got earlier for the, what I've been doing for the last couple of days. Uh, yes, he was deciding which way to do it. What's my choices? I'm going to take a look at my choices here. How do I want to do this? Why? Because his father's not talking to him. He's not a man. Also, he doesn't have the respect, leadership. He doesn't have it all. He knows he doesn't have it all. Uh, and he can't get his father's attention. The hidden root here is his father okay the emperor the crown his father problems there the focal point is megan's emotions always megan playing on with emotions the past position doesn't serve is his cold ice queen her probably encouraging him very cruel ruthless energy yeah go ahead harry i don't care do whatever you want so this is here with the page of wands is blazing a new path Let's blaze a new path. I'm, I've got the energy to do it. It takes energy to do something like that. Um, then I got here, the feelings in the situation, it's the only way to heal with the three of swords in reverse. The outside influences would be, it was good luck and good karma and better luck for everyone involved, especially the family. And for him, because he can get out of the situation. Uh, the hopes and fears is he fears the fact that he is not a charismatic swag leader. He is very much beta male, not alpha male. He does not radiate power. Uh, basically, this is no impact and no vision. Can't do what he wants to do. So what do you do? Then the final card I got, the final card I did get was this card. You know what this card is, okay? The death card. So he figured also, then I, the next cards I got here was the moon, the fantasy. The fantasy and the illusion created this rock bottom feeling for him with the ten of wands. Decided, yeah, I need to I need to leave. This is getting out of the situation. Just let go. Abandon daily routine. Drifter. No longer concerned about past issues. Just wanting to get out of it. Get out of the situation. Walking away for empowerment. And he realized, and go to the light. Seed the situation. Go to the light. Uh, learning from life lessons. He learned from life lessons that that he needed to be professional. He wasn't a professional. That's why he's not that charismatic swag leader, leader figure. People look at him as low level, low level. He learned that he should have gone to school. He should have educated himself more. He also learned that you got to be very careful who you partner up with, with the two of cups, who your dualities are. He was forewarned. And what he ended up getting was burdened energy and not able to ever rebuild under extreme pressure to be able to rebuild. It's on his back to come in and clean this mess up. This is clean up the mess you created with the tower in reverse. And then this here, I take it as a, as a note, you know what kind of note I'm talking about. And speaking the brutal truth here, uh, pointing out the errors with the page of swords there in reverse. Feeling a total complete rock bottom here. Uh, it's the lesson. He's getting the lesson of betrayal with the Ten of Swords. A total end is here. Giving up with the Nine of Wands in reverse. No longer persevering. Giving up on the family and ever getting back in the family. Having this repeated psychological pattern of failure and needing peace and give the, the family peace and then this situation would be good luck, good karma, and better for the family. And seeing that his exit would be a blessing to the family, in essence, uh, is what I got here. So I just wanted to give this out there. Uh, I know you didn't see me pull it, but I just did it. And I just decided to leave it all here. Yeah, definitely in that headspace. I don't think that he is faking it. I think that he doesn't care either way. He wants to be rescued hoping to be probably rescued, but not expecting it based on this, that it has come to this point in his life. So there you go. This might be probably just a short video. So, all right, um, we shall stay on top of this and see how it unfolds. But this is what I've been saying for a very long time. Those of you that have been following me for many years, I have always said it would come to this point for Harry. He's got abandonment wounds, abandonment issues, and everybody's abandoned him, including Megan. 
She has abandoned him. She's like, I don't care what you do. She's being very ruthless. So I try telling you what I want emotionally, but you know, you got to talk to your family. Give me what I want from your family. Give me money. You can't do it. So total failure energy. All right, you guys. Bye.